Hey everybody, Christopher out here. Welcome back to The Witcher 2. We finally found Triss. She's safe at last. And now we need to get her out of here. Which I imagine isn't going to be like the smoothest operation. But we'll soon find out. So, uh, Triss, this is... These are all the uh, dead bodies that I've recently Those no slain. guardians. That's your work? <laughs> yes, they followed their leader too blindly. You killed them all. They didn't slaughter themselves. Don't judge me. I'm hoping this is the right way to go. This is, it is actually, it doesn't make me look, you know, good. But I didn't really have a choice in the matter. Oh, what do we have back here? Hold on, Triss. Wait a second. Have we been down here? Oh, this takes me back into the sewers. Okay, not a big deal. We shouldn't arrive at the same time. Let's split up. Again? Triss. Yes? That was some mess. I wouldn't want to see you hurt like that again. Don't worry. I'll manage. See you at the talks. All right. Man, I know she's tough and everything, but like, let's be serious. Every time we split up, it doesn't really work out. Oh, wow. I have three talents to put in? Okay. So what else do I have? Um, I'm pretty happy with the way everything is right now. Uh, I'm not sure if it's worth going the second level of combat acumen. Invincible could be good. Extra vitality and damage reduction. Let's do that. And then... Maybe I'll just go up the instant kill ladder. Oh, actually, let's maybe take this. Adrenaline builds even faster. And then let's see over here. I could just get a vitality boost. I could set more Urden traps, but I think two is pretty good. What about down here? Is there anything worthwhile just grabbing? Not really. Let's cover, let's do distance covered while dodging in battle 200%. Just some extra mobility. Okay, that was big. No time for embraces, explanations, and thanks. Brave as ever, Triss helped Geralt gather his wits, and they retreated from the enemy camp with utmost speed. So, now we need to join the deliberations. Alone on a sorcerer's summit, the Witcher would feel like a raftsman on a declamation contest. Luckily, Triss Marigold awaited him at the amphitheater's entrance. Geralt ran his fingers through his hair, took a deep breath, and entered the meeting place at Triss's side. Now, what's interesting is this... Oh, okay, that makes sense as to why he got so many talents there. What's interesting is that um, this this amphitheater is supposedly protected by magic, and so theoretically, everything should be kind of safe. Let's see here. I'm just going to quickly check and see if there's anything worth selling. Uh, the armor of Vicavaro I can sell. I imagine, I have a feeling that 
a lot of stuff I'm not really going to need much of anymore. It would be great if you could sort by the number of items that you have, but that doesn't seem to be the case. Medal of Distinguished Service to Temeria. Ooh, I never even noticed that. That's kind of a cool trophy. It's not as good as what I'm currently using, but... I'm gonna actually take a second here to craft some alchemy stuff. I don't know how much use I'm gonna have for it, but... Let's just be prepared. Intriga Embryo, is there anything else I can use? I have a bunch of them, so I should be okay. Okay, good. Actually, do I have anything else here as well? Harpy eyes, good. And I think I have some cat potions, but I don't know what to expect. I feel like we're kind of entering the point of no return right now. And actually, you know what? I'm gonna make some brown oil as well. And maybe just, I'll make just a couple of these oils for, for everything. Because I don't know if we're going to be facing anything weird. Blinds and freezes all. Yeah, let's make a bunch of these. I haven't even really used these. Okay. Break your wands! Oh, I don't have it actually set up either. So let's get rid of this lure. Throw this up here. So this blinds and freezes. This stuns and freezes. That Zerkinian sun actually looks pretty and good. And the bat! The owl! And the rat! And I know exactly where this amphitheater is. It's past the dead dwarf. By where we found Arian Lavalette earlier. But I don't think we could get anywhere past here. Barbarian. Are you thirsty? Oops. Okay. Have a nice stay in Loch Muin. So, even the Nilf Guardians have graced us with. We're about to witness a great event. Give me a minute. Well, I don't know what else I would do around Wait for here. Me. Whatever it is, make it quick. Your Excellency knows well that our hosts are libertines and eccentrics. My dear counselor, northern business should truly remain no. I mean, I can't see presence. anything else that Forgive we would need me, to be doing right now, I so let's disagree. get going. We're about to yeah, I can't wait. Let's go inside. It's now or never. In recent weeks, we have deliberated extensively in Vizima on who is to succeed to the Temerian throne. Because the fate of Foltest's last child remains unknown, we could not reach an agreement. Unable to reconcile the interests of the esteemed Temerian houses, we have no choice but to divide the country into provinces along the Barony's current borders. This cannot be, John Natalis. Temeria stands between Nilfgaard and the North. It must be a strong and united realm. I too would wish it so, Your Majesty. But when Foltest was cut down by an assassin, the country's very heart burst. I have learned that Anais Lavalette is currently in the hands of the sorcerer Deathmold. Clearly you have yet to learn of the slaughter that occurred today in the Kedweni camp, King Radovid. Yet there is hope if the child lives. I shall do everything in my power to find her. Simultaneously, I wish to announce that the commander of the Temerian Special Forces, one Vernon Roach, is officially a wanted man. Whoa. All privileges appertaining to him as an officer of the realm are hereby repealed. They're going to be a little bit surprised to see us, I think.
to the matter at hand. The document describing the charter of the Council and the Conclave is, as previously ascertained, an exact copy of the charter found in the ruins on Thaned Island. The more important question relates to the Conclave and its power to designate royal advisers. Today, randomly chosen majors and sorceresses reside at many courts. However, in the time of the previous Conclave, such persons were carefully chosen. As they should be. Why shouldn't we pick our own advisors? Exactly. These individuals bear great responsibility, Your Majesty. The Conclave needs to be certain they are competent. And that they will keep the Conclave's interests in mind. Obviously, sire. The Conclave's chief interest is the well-being and prosperity of the Northern Kingdoms. The document has been signed by every member of the Conclave we have proposed as well as by all but one of the designated advisers. We await only Sheila de Tanserville's signature. Without our royal seals, you should be allowed to designate advisers to Cowherd at most. That is true, Your Majesty. <laughs> Sheila de Tanserville should never be allowed to sign this document. Triss Merigold, you decided to join us after all. De Tanserville has royal blood on her hands. She can't sit on the Conclave. That is a lie. Have you anything to support these claims, Mary Gold? There are witnesses who will confirm that Sheila de Tanserville was behind the assassinations of Demavend and Foltest. Officials of the future Council and Conclave. Sheila de Tanserville should be arrested and tried. If Triss Merigold speaks the truth, Lady de Tanserville will be condemned to death. Are here. Sheila de Tanserville, until Triss Marigold's charges are dismissed or refuted, you cannot sit on the conclave. Arrest her. I don't see her going easily. You don't know the whole truth. Marigold doesn't know what she's talking about. Destroy me. Okay, this isn't. You put her up on top of this thing, I think. Stand back while you can, Lisa. Whoa. You can't stop me. Not you, not anyone else. Oh, great, now this is gonna just follow behind if me. If I have to, I will kill you. Oh, shit. Wow. This seems like a little bit of an unbalanced battle. How you like my dragon? Yeah, he's great. Super friendly. Your dragon's really fantastic. Sesenthesis is his name. That's cool. You're late. I've already managed to stabilize the portal. You've got nowhere to run. Sooner or later, somebody will find you. I prefer to leave on my own terms. Where's Letho? Sesenthesis will tend to him, as she will to all the fools who get a hard-on at the mere thought of burning a sorceress at the stake. 
Where is he? I don't know, fool. I've been looking for him since Foltest's assassination. Letho cheated all of us. We were deceived by his dull face and sluggish stare. Don't you understand? The Lodge sought a way to get rid of Demavend, that's true. He was a weak, volatile king. Edurn would eventually choke to death under his rule. We chose the lesser evil. He had to be eliminated, and Letho happened to be at hand. Foltest? Henselt? We had nothing to do with that. After assassinating Demavend, Letho used our gold and magical support to find and meet Yorveth. The elf was to help him hide until the matter blew over, or so I thought. The Lodge did not condemn Foltest to die. Then who did? Nilfgaard. Letho is the King of Liars and Emperor of Traitors. From the start, he worked for the glory of the Great Sun and the White Flame dancing on the graves of his foes. He lied to everyone. Me, Yorveth, your stupid little Triss, and you. Got any evidence? A moment ago, I received a message from the Lodge's agent in Sintra. The Imperial Army is on the move. They're fording the Yoruga now. Do you think the North can defend itself in the current situation? Not really. And can you count on another miracle at Brenna? Probably not. I don't know, but you made it all possible and you'll answer for that. The stigma of treason is yours for all time. We shall see. For no one will leave this city alive. No one will tell this story. Philippa controls the dragon. As soon as I disappear, it will turn the city into a flaming tomb. The dragon attacked Foltest's troops during the siege of Lavalette Castle. That hardly supports your tale. We did not control it then. We may have lost a battle, but the war is just beginning. You, however, shall not take part in it. This is your end. So how Witcher. did they control the dragon then? Farewell! That. Something's not right! The diamonds! Someone replace the diamonds! Oh. This one's flawed! I'll be torn to bits! Geralt, remove it! What? I can't move. Okay. You waited long enough. Should you survive, go south to Nilfgaard. You're welcome. Where you'll find Yennefer of Vengerberg. Oh. Farewell, that hits home. Witcher. Sensitive guy. Okay, so I guess if I wouldn't have done anything there, then... Uh... What? Damn it. So if I wouldn't have done anything there, jeez, then she would have died? I couldn't move, I couldn't do anything. I probably would have let her die. Oh. Nice, yeah, here we go, okay. The dragon's a wee bit predictable. Except for that, that's... Oh, he got me. Oh, making some space. Don't like it. Oh, jeez. <laughs> this is insane. Whoa. And I can't get any potions going or anything. Oh. Oh, I should never turn my back to this thing. Oh. oh, go right through it. Oh, I went over it. That, nope, did not go over that. Oh, get away from me, dragon. Damn it again. Oh, I gotta be careful here. Whoa! Oh, this is insane. Oh, I keep going through it. Come on, shoot over here. There you go. Oh, is that it? Come on, slice its head off. Okay. Well, uh, I'm hopefully. Oh, thank God. Let's potion up here.
I should really try some powers against it, but... I'll, well, I'll give it a shot. See how this goes. I kind of need to make sure that I always have Quen going on, though. Great. You know what? I'm throwing a whetstone on here. No. Nope. Here we go. Here we go. Shit, you stink. Well, what the hell? Whoa! Jeez! Come on, Vigor, let's go! What am I supposed to do against this thing? Uh, that doesn't really do anything. What about these other ones? Where is it? Dragon? Whoa! That was kind of a waste. I feel like I can't even get close to it. Oh, it got me. Oh. Alright, it's doing a little bit of damage. Is it? I can't really tell. <laughs> right there. He could have just ended me. I don't know. That doesn't seem to be doing anything at all. I'll see if I can get some art going on him. Oh! Up, 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 up. Oh, go, 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 go. Okay. Oh, that does a little bit. I just, I'm gonna have to suck it up and get in there. Take a seat. Oh, God. Damn, it humbles me. Wow. Oh. Come on, perch. That, did you? God, he's mobile too, like all over the place. I wonder if I'm missing something really easy. Come on. I don't like it. I'm way too close. Just get the quick little jabs in. What? Oh, are you kidding me? Now he's got a tail to abuse. Whoa. Oh, that worked out pretty well. Okay. That. Oh, Jesus! <laughs> this thing is insane. I don't know what to do. I guess just play it slow. Damn it. Oh. 
I'm just like, I'm just like hitting it with toothpicks at this point. Oh. Okay, you got another one of those in you? Oh. There you go, take a seat. Oh, weak. Okay, this thing needs to go down. If I can get it to like lunge at me like it did that one time, that would be ideal. Look at him cheap, he just comes up, does his little swipe. Oh no! That's that, okay, that's not the lunge I was talking about. Wow. Oh, it's close, close. Wow. Mm. This is ridiculous. for the potions, I swear. Oh! Oh, did we do it? I think it is. Whoa. What? God, I don't know. If I leave him there, like, I'm sympathetic to his sense, but. Oh my God, I don't know what to do. Kill the dragon or walk away. If I walk away, it's just gonna sit there and suffer until it dies. Oh, it's probably just doing what it's told. <laughs> 